56-83 has stood for a while. It was set by Santa Marta Bravo from Spain back in Sydney. So Teresina Vilamina herself will be competing in heat number two. Here is Talita Simplicio de Silva. Felipe Veloso is her guide. 58-22 her best would see her win this heat if she was able to produce it. From Mexico, Diana Carazza Castaneda comes into this race at 21 years of age. We have Esperanza Jacasso from Angola in five and larger Ishtatili from Namibia is in lane number seven. Ishtatili competing in three events here, the 100, 200 and 400. Fourth in Leon in the 400. That was a while ago, three years ago. Simplicio de Silva is the silver medalist in the relay and also reigning bronze medalist at the Worlds over 400 metres. We do see the reigning world champion in this discipline, Liu Liu King, in the third heat. Ready and away, first time of asking. Karatsa Castaneda on the inside was away cleanly. And showing good speed is Simplicio da Silva. And is uh, going to be in front of Jacasso as they head into the back. Ishatili looks like she's the one to run down. Ishatili leads down the back straight. Simplicio da Silva is really running hard down the back section and gets past Jacasso. And then a gap to Karatsa Castaneda. Off the back past the 200. Ishatili in front, but now Simplicio de Silva runs on by, comes up to the turn. It's pretty loud in the stadium, and we still have Guilhermina to run in the next heat. But Simplicio de Silva goes away for Brazil. Carazza Castaneda may be a danger on the inside. Simplicio de Silva in front with 50 metres to go. Is she getting tired? I don't think she is. Out wide, Ishatili's coming again. The first will go through automatically, and it's a Brazilian. Simplicio de Silva is the winner. Throws herself down on the track after it. She has given her all from Ishatili in second place. Carazzo Castaneda in third place ahead of Jacasso. And the time, 58-71, automatically qualifies. So the three heat winners will go through to the final. Then the next quickest will advance. And it is... A regional record for Ishatili, and it's a personal best for Carazzo Castaneda. And if you think there was some noise in the Olympic Stadium now, we haven't seen Terrazinha Guilamina yet. Absolutely, 58-71, very impressive. Close to a lifetime best set this year of 58-22. I thought she was fading quite a bit over the last 50. Well guided by Felipe Veloso, and Ishatili was climbing fast, and she's taken a Two and a quarter seconds off a lifetime best is Utilia in second place with that new African record. But she got away very well, Simplicio de Silva. Remember, she's only 19 years old. She turned 19 during the Olympics. Well clear at this stage. Karatza was in second place for Mexico on the inside. But look at Ishitile move. A huge margin between Simplicio de Silva and Ishitile by that stage. And certainly the Brazilian was fading and just figuratively crawled over the line. Ishitile would have taken her had it been any further. A little bit more stamina for the Brazilian and she probably would have won by another second. I mean, just look at the gap by this stage on the turn. Well cleared, just look at the support coming from Veloso. He obviously felt that things were beginning to go a little bit wrong for his colleague there. And the pace and the rhythm, while never ragged, was beginning to decelerate. Chicasso, I thought, had lost her rhythm on the back straight, struggled from there, even though it was a lifetime best for her of 104.17. Simplicio de Silva just getting over the line, like the branding on the blindfold as well. The Agitos will go down very well. She's got the win, 58.71. It took a lot out of her, we know that.
Victory for Brazil. Simplicio da Silva, 58-71. Only one fastest loser across the three heats at the moment. It's Ishitile, 58.